हेलो गेस वेलकम टू माई चैनल टूडेज टॉपिक इज गैस लाइन पॉइजनिंग इन दिस टॉपिक वी विल डिस्कस द हार्मफुल इफेक्ट्स ऑफ द दैट कैन इफेक्ट यू by swallowing or breathing uh, in the gasoline fumes you know and the information is only for the uh, awareness purpose so it, this is not a medical advice and if uh, you or someone is having this problem you should consult the nearest emergency room or your doctor thank you now the gasoline contains uh, some poisonous ingredients Uh, like uh, hydrocarbons uh, which are substance that uh, contain only hydrogen and carbon uh, examples are benzene and uh, methane you know now these ingredients are found in gasoline uh, now the symptoms of the gasoline poisoning include like uh, well we will uh, discuss this area wise you know so for example if uh, uh, air airways and lungs you know and that uh, symptom may be the difficulty in uh, breathing difficulty you know and uh, throat swelling uh, now it may cause uh, pain in ear nose and throat and uh, it can cause the vision loss as well uh, it can cause abdominal pain or the blood bloody stools or burns on the esophagus that's a food pipe and vomiting and possibly with the blood you know uh, it can uh, cause the uh, collapse it can cause low blood pressure uh, which develops very quickly you know and uh, it uh, it uh, can cause many symptoms uh, uh, of the nervous system like uh, dizziness or depression or drowsiness or convulsions you know or feeling of uh, being drunk you know or headaches or uh, loss of alertness or uh, staggering you know and weakness and it may cause the skin burns and irritation on the skin as well uh, now if you are anyone else you see uh, uh, is suffering from the gas uh, gasoline poisoning you know you should consult the emergency room straight away you should call the ambulance or rush to the nearest emergency room and if the chemical is uh, on the skin or in the eyes and you know, if uh, the chemicals uh, are swallowed immediately give a person uh, uh, water or milk you know uh, unless uh, instructed otherwise uh, by the provider and you do not give water or milk if the person is unconscious or has a decreased level of alertness now if the person uh, breathe uh, in the poison immediately move uh, to the fresh air you know and uh, uh, once you call the emergency services uh, so you should try to contact uh, i mean get the person's age you know and its weight and uh, the condition you know and the time the gasoline poisoning happened and the the, uh, the amount uh, uh, he swallowed or breathed you know and you should also contact uh, contact to the poison control center as well so they are helpful uh, uh, you should take uh, uh, the container that contains that uh, uh, gasoline with you to the hospital so it can help the doctors uh, to manage the condition in a better way because they know what was in that container you know and what kind of the kind of the fuel or the gasoline was uh, in that container that the person has uh, swallowed or inhaled you know and uh, your doctor will measure or monitor the person's vital signs like blood pressure temperature pulse breathing rate and the symptoms will be treated uh, as appropriate you know and the person may receive like a breathing spot you know and uh, bronchoscopy bronchoscopy is a camera placed uh, uh, down the throat to see the burns in the airways and the lungs you know and the chest x rays and uh, heart tracing you know known as ek ag you know endoscopy 
uh, the fluids through the veins you know and uh, and the surgical removal of the burned skin okay and uh, tube through the mouth into the stomach to wash the strum uh, stomach you know and it's called uh, gastric uh, lavage and washing of skin um, which is known as irrigation you know skin irrigation uh, well the prognosis depends on how well a person uh, does depend on the amount of the poison swallowed and how quickly the treatment was received you know and the faster a person gets the medical help the better the chances of recovery are uh, thank you very much for watching this video if you need more information you can visit our website www.diseasesandtreatment.com and uh, please do not forget to subscribe uh, share um, and uh, like these videos just to support this channel thank you goodbye